Y'all get ready? Yes, you get ready. Shout out to all my tea sippers out there. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your tea cups ready because you already know this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, so I want to come on here and do an update on the whole situation concerning Deja and T.I. You guys know I did the video the other day about T.I. basically telling the whole world that his daughter's hymen was still intact and she's still a virgin and all this goofy shit. And, of course, Deja has been embarrassed for, like, the past week on social media. So now what went down is that basically this weekend... Her, her older sister, Zonique Pullins. Now, Zonique is Tiny's daughter with somebody else. That is not T.I.'s child. I see a lot of y'all mixing this up and thinking that, you know, Zonique is T.I.'s biological child. She's not, okay? She's still his daughter, but not biologically. Deja is his only biological daughter. So I hope that clears that up to people who are going back and forth and arguing in the damn comment section about it. Any damn ways. Um, Zonique and Regine and Deja... Toya and Tiny, they all went down to Mexico to go kick it, go have fun, go relax. You know, all that good stuff, okay? You know how rich people do, honey. When they're stressed, they take vacations down to damn Cancun. But anyways, while they're down there, Regina decides to, you know, go live and she starts dancing, you know, all sexual. You know, she starts winding and twisting. And yes, I'm wearing a half shirt because I'm still in the damn Miami mood, okay? So Regina's dancing and twisting and wilding and just, you know, doing her damn thing on camera. So then all of a sudden, Zani comes out of nowhere with this big old booty. Don't know where it came from, but she starts twerking. Turkey, 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 dropping it like it's hot. So, okay, cool. All right, we got Zonique, you know what I'm saying? Putting in work. We got Regina, you know, just grinding and shit. All of a sudden, Deja walks into the... <laughs> All of a sudden, Deja walks into the frame, you know, ready to dance, but she's not realizing that it's, you know, being recorded. So she walks in all cute, ready to dance, and she's like, hold up, what is this? What is this? And Regina is like looking at her like, girl, if you don't move so I can finish, you know what I'm saying, slow winding and shit. So Deja's like, no, what is this? And so then Deja realizes that the camera's on and they're recording. Deja just, she literally runs out the damn scene, okay? It was so <laughs> it was funny because it's like, uh-uh, oh, hell no, my dad might be watching. You guys will not get me in more trouble with Mr. Expeditiously, okay? Here we go. We got it right there. So she gets the hell out the frame. So, of course, that caused more controversy on social media. People were like, oh, my gosh, she can't even enjoy her life. She can't even dance without, you know, the, her father done put the fear of God in her. This is so sad. This is, you know, mental abuse. So a lot of people had a lot of things to say. But I have been watching Family Hustle off and on throughout the years. And I feel like Deja's personality, she's more the shy one. Now, granted, she takes, you know, pictures and she models on social media, but that's a lot different than, you know, a camera, like a video camera being in your face, recording your every move. She's always been more standoffish of the camera than her siblings. Like her brothers, they love the camera. They love the attention, especially King. She's always just kind of been more subdued. So I wasn't really shocked by her reaction, but her reaction was just funny because you could tell she's ready to dance and, you know, twerk and have fun with her sisters. But again, she's the type of person where she feels like everything is not for the gram everything is not for social media and I definitely agree with her you know having that mentality but then I also can see what people are saying it seems like she's scared to do anything because T.I. is always you know, saying lurking and shit around corners making sure that his daughter does not grow up to be the same women that he keeps cheating on his wife with okay sincerely T.I. I feel like that's his mentality he wants to raise her a certain way you know what I'm saying but it's okay for other people's you know like I said uh daughters hymens to be tampered with but not his own you know so that whole situation situation's a mess but now where the drama comes in is that after the vacation this weekend um people noticed that Deja unfollowed her father they did a search for you know Deja following T.I. and that shit came up no search found okay so she unfollowed T.I. on social media she also unfollowed Tiny and she also unfollowed Zonique so a lot of people are like, oh my gosh, what's going on? Is she mad at Zonique because of how the whole video thing played out? Is she mad because Tiny hasn't had her back and said anything? We all know why she's mad at her father, honey. But I can't, you know, I don't know what's going on with her sister and, um, you know, her stepmom. I'm confused about that. But as of now.
now she's not following all three of them. So I don't know what's going on there. I'm sure she followed them at one point. I don't think it'd be a situation where she never followed them. That wouldn't make any sense. But as of now, she has unfollowed them. So it seems like there's still a lot of unresolved issues. And I think it probably will not be resolved until T.I. speaks out about this publicly. And he publicly apologizes to his child in the same way he publicly shamed her and put her business out there. You know, I don't blame her for unfollowing her father. I think she's really, really hurt by this situation and you know she's only 18 she's still a baby so she's still trying to figure out how to process all this on top of the trolls who keep coming at her people talking about you know I'll pay you money for your virginity you know all types of sick stuff that I'm seeing her going through as a young child that she didn't need that that unneeded or unwarranted attention at all so I think her father definitely needs to address this publicly that's not something that you do it's nobody's business you know what I'm saying your child's virginity what goes on with her at the doctor that's no one's business but Deja's and for that to be blasted publicly, I don't agree with that at all. So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping, honey. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation with Deja, honey, trying to run up out that frame. She was like, y'all would not have me on camera twerking and having a good old funky time because I'm not trying to hear my damn dad's mouth, okay? How did y'all feel about that? And then how do you guys feel about these new revelations that basically Deja has unfollowed not only T.I., but also unfollowed Tiny and Zanique as well, okay? So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, honey. Make sure you hit the like button. And then also don't forget to hit that notification bell so that way you can be down with the notification squad. So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation, honey. Once again, concerning Deja Harris basically cutting a lot of folks off this weekend, okay? So let me know your thoughts. All right, deuces.